A Kansas City, Kansas church is now recovering after being vandalized earlier this year, trying to make progress before the holidays. For the folks at Bethel Seventh Day Adventist, there is simply no time to dwell on what happened to them back in June. And now KCTV 5's Nathan Vickers has more for us new at four. The Bethel Seventh Day Adventist Church is still working on restoring their damaged building. But even through that process, they're still helping nearby families in need. It's exciting to see the light. Pastor Brian Mann says his congregation has grown stronger over the past few months. We've had our exercise, our spiritual exercise. This was the church's sanctuary in June, after several people broke in through the front door, trashing pews, offices, musical instruments, and the church food pantry. Then a strong storm damaged the roof and steeple. We've been through a lot. But through all that, the church has persevered meeting in a different building and keeping its food pantry running once a month. It was something that we couldn't stop. Now the renovations and repairs to the church are almost done. Uh, we have a new floor in the room, painted the walls. And Mann says they'll be able to move back into the building just in time for the holidays. That'll be a great thing to um, get this pantry back up and going and, and to do it in a big way. KCK police charged several teens and an adult for the break-in. Mann says they likely won't face charges. He says his congregation is glad for that. We want that. We don't hold ill feelings uh, about what they have done. Um, we, we're just praying for them. And now the church is ready to move forward. When terrible things happen, we come together. The congregation also plans to resume church services here in this building in the next few weeks. In KCK, Nathan Vickers, KCTV 5.